you know, I just really just wanted everything to work out and it just, it gets so hard. Is that what you thought I was gonna say? <laughs> well, this is the path I have chosen for myself and I must continue on. Otherwise, what am I doing this for? I just wanna be in bed, but here I am painting. Welcome or welcome back. This is Simply Haley Cherie and I am Simply Haley Cherie. I guess since we have already started, you can like, comment, share, subscribe or whatever. It does help me out though. So do what you want. I realized that I forgot to show you guys the beginning of a painting. I'm so sorry. Forgive me. So I'm here to show you this painting and to continue this painting and to hopefully show you the progress of this painting. And before I do that, I will show you how I started it because I started it on TikTok. <laughs> which you should follow me on because I think seem to start things there and then post on YouTube. So you might want to see them first there. But I do go into more detail on YouTube. So please stay and subscribe, please. <laughs> what are hiccups even? What do they do? What are they for? What do they mean? I do not know. Somebody tell me, please. I'm rambling. Um, here's the videos. <laughs> So this is actually the second um, piece in my collection, in my first ever collection, The Hidden Girls. And this one is a cloud girl. And she is, I don't know if they're girls or women. I feel like it's more women. But anyway, I started with putting the gesso on and then laying down like the colors of where I thought I wanted it to go, kind of. That's what I like to do. I guess it's like underpainting. I'm not sure of the technical terms, you guys. I did not go to art school or art anything. I took art classes in high school. If you want to count that, that's it. I still don't know what I'm doing. And it was still drawing. I've never, this is my first time painting. I'm rambling again. I did the underpainting. I laid down the colors that I thought I wanted where I wanted them. And that's how I left it for the first day. And the second day, the next day, I decided to get a little bit more detailed on the clouds and where I wanted the clouds. And I used up a lot of paint, so I actually had to go to Michael to get more of the same colors so I could paint today. But yeah, I started getting more detailed into the clouds. I got a new brush, the red brush, the red fluffy brush is new because I want. I needed a particular kind of brush and I couldn't find it or I didn't have it. And it is working very well, but I find myself having to go back in with these super tiny small brushes and I knew that it was gonna take me so long to get this done. Because I'm, I get so detailed and the little brush is the only thing that's going to get the right details and the right amount of blending that I'm looking for. And I kept blending and I kept blending and blending and blending and shaping and making clouds and painting over things and redoing things. And so I finished that and now we're back to where we are today. I still have more clouds to paint and I still have to put the lady in there. And I also need to color in some of the clouds because when I look at it, it feels a little bit unbalanced to me. My family really likes the way it is already, but I know that there's a little bit of some missing Peace. So we're gonna get those in. <laughs> so that's what I'm gonna work on today. I still have to film for TikTok. Also, let me say I'm really scared about the TikTok ban. I just talked about it today, but it does scam me a little bit because I feel like I just got started. But I mean, I'll be on here for YouTube. Ah! I will post. I post. I will post all of my TikToks on YouTube Shorts. I think in due time. I don't hold me. I mean, hold me to it. But don't be surprised if it comes out a month later, okay? <laughs> it is raining a lot. I just want to be in bed. But here I am painting because this is my job that I am creating for myself. Yes, hallelujah. I'm self-employed. I also need to finish my business website. Okay, let's get painting. So Mike's going to start sitting down. So I'm on the floor right now because I need to work on this part up here. To get a little bit more in the way that I think it should be because this is my painting and I can decide how it's supposed to look. Man, there really is nothing in here. That's why I had to get a second one of these. My main colors are rose, pink, magenta. Why is it called that weird quick fluorescent pink and primary yellow? Oh, I need white. I need my white. And white. Oh, I hate this brush. It's, no, that's not working. Absolutely not. Hello, so I'm gonna jump in real quick before I continue the painting because I wanted to add in some voiceover and this is the only way that I can f figure out how to do that. So I'm gonna be watching and I'm gonna be talking. I might jump in, you might see me a couple more times, but 
honestly I doubt it because what's the point of seeing me if you're, you're already hearing me but anyway so I really just wanted to start off with putting all these different colors on because honestly looking at it it felt really unbalanced and I felt like the colors that I previously put down just weren't the right ones and also because I tried to I feel like I may have tried to rush the painting a little bit it felt like the colors were very unblended so the majority of this painting is me going over and over or going back over several different places in the painting to get not only the right color or try to color match the color that's already on there but to continue to get a good blended base because it was just all splotchy it's getting a lot darker because it's raining so i'm gonna turn the light on so that i can see because i can't see right now i can look at everything and actually see what i'm liking and what i'm not and let it be known there was quite a few things that i did not like like i said earlier i just keep having to go over places that just don't make sense to me in my head they look rough they look unfinished and that is not what i was trying to give in this painting so it was really frustrating having to basically repaint this entire painting over and over again with such a small brush My mom got me and my sister chocolate croissants. Delicious. I don't know if you can hear it, but the rain is raining, raining hard. And to be honest, it's making me lose my, lose my motivation. But I'll keep going. Well, this is the path I have chosen for myself and I must continue on. Otherwise, what am I doing this for? So let's go. <laughs> Let it also be known that with every falling raindrop, I lose motivation. I don't want to paint anymore. I just want to lay in bed and read. The rain is really just sucking out of me. I love rain. I love listening to rain, but it's just like, it's cloud, it's cloud, it's cloudy, it's dark, and I'm just like, let's stop and just relax. But I will paint a little bit more. So let's get into it. I felt as though some places in my painting were lacking in colors, like I needed a couple more clouds, so I went in and did that. Had to make sure I get the edges because I'm not about to be out here with unfinished edges. That is not cute. And I just felt like seeing it on the wall would be really nice if you could see that the edges were done. That's my time. I have to post on TikTok and edit. So I am done for right now. I need to edit and then I'll probably take a break and then eat lunch and then get back to this. But yeah, I need to post. I have to edit two videos today and I have 30 minutes to do so. I really have less than 30 minutes. I really need to get started. Okay, enough rambling. Huzzah. Woohoo. Let's go. It is taking so long to upload. It's at 87% and I still have one more to upload. And it's past my time of uploading. Come on. Get it together. I finished uploading my TikToks. Um, and I'm, t I'm done today. I'm tired. I finished filming my TikToks. Not filming. I finished editing and posting my TikToks. And I am now tired. I'm eating lunch. Um, and yeah. I will see you guys after lunch, I guess. I don't know. I am so tired. The rain is great, but it makes me tired. <laughs> it's two days later, and uh, I was um, asleep after that last clip. I just gave up on painting. So um, we will continue today. So what's good? It's a different day, but let's continue this painting and now I can mainly focus on YouTube because a lot of the time what gets in the way is me filming for TikTok and YouTube at the same time. It does work but it's a little bit difficult but this time I'm only f mainly. I'm mainly focused on tic um, YouTube so I will do that and we can I'm, I'm getting this done. I want to finish it today. I Haley sh Haley I, Haley Cherie, am not pledging because that's a little bit too pressurizing. I am saying that I shall try my hardest to finish this painting today. Let's go. Okay, so this is where we left off. And now we just got to finish the details. I got to add some more of that over here, you know, balance the colors a little bit. And put the lady up there and all that jazz. Let's go! Also, let me say this. Um, the gardeners are outside for everyone today. So, um, it's going to be noisy. And I don't know when they're going to stop. So, um, I apologize. Look at this real quick. I saved the paint. It's still freaking squishy. 
I put it in the fridge. I don't know if you're supposed to do that, but that's what I did. Ah! Yes, I was very proud of myself for having saved the paint because it really made a little bit of a difference because I'm trying not to spend too much money on paint all the time. I'd rather save just a little bit of money to put towards, I don't know, canvases maybe, but yeah, I had to add another cloud because I had one on the other side. It didn't make sense to have one on one side and not the other. It just looked wrong, so I fixed that. And then I got working more and more on the rest of the clouds because I needed something. There was just a lot of empty space or a lot of non-dimension. And I think overall, if I look back on it, I would have made bigger clouds because it felt as if there was a whole bunch of small clouds everywhere. It looked a little crowded. And actually adding in the darker colors on the clouds was nice. So as you can see, I've gotten hot. I changed into a tank top and I put my hair up. I had to get a light out because the light is changing because it rained. So the clouds are just moving over the sun and it's making it harder for me to paint. But something is going on. Like I, my heart starts racing and get really hot. Like over the course of this like two hours that I've been painting, I don't know what's going on. So I'm going to take a little break. I'm going to eat and see if that's what I needed. But yeah, it didn't feel, it didn't feel good. It didn't feel, uh, Safe? I don't know. I don't know. Don't tell my family. I already told them. So it's fine. The dogs are driving me insane, but I have eaten. Look a little crazy. Eaten, had dessert. Now we can get back to this. I'm excited to finish it. Let's put it that way. Now I'm repainting another one of the clouds at the top because the color just wasn't working out. It was too splotchy. It just didn't make any sense. It just looked wrong. And I wanted to extend it a little bit further on the canvas as well. And let me say, color matching is a big... Like, it's really hard to get the colors that I specified because I'm mixing all the colors by hand. But I kept trying and keep repainting. My dog is barking. My hair is starting to look crazier. <laughs> Excuse me. I feel like I'm basically just problem solving and trying to figure out how to make the colors balance in a way that makes sense so and i feel like i just had a breakthrough so that's exciting i'm on the floor now i'm getting tired getting irritated but we are in the home stretch sort of there's a whole other section up there i have to do and i said i was gonna finish it today i still might we'll see you know, now that I'm thinking about everything, I probably could have just uh, put music over the painting instead of talking, but here I am talking. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to go back in again, add the colors on the edges, make sure it's all continuous because I'm thinking that when it's on the wall, it's going to look real pretty. And honestly, painting the girl was one of the most satisfying ones I've done in a while. I just love how soft she turned out and not too harsh. But also, I wish she stood out less because she does seem a little obvious to me which is kind of So I thing. just need to add the finishing touches and I am done. Look at my hand. I really like it. Um, I hope you like it. <sighs> These little finishing touches is honestly one of the best parts of the whole painting process for me. Now I just take a couple of the colors I was using. I try to get as many as I can on my thumb. Yellow. So it looks like this. And then I just, bam. I'm done. I can't show you right now cause it's getting darker. So I'll show you tomorrow, but I am done. I really like it. Um, I hope you like it, like for real, for real. Like, I feel like I could have done a little bit better, but I feel like if I kept going and kept trying to change everything, it would have turned to crap. So, see you tomorrow. I am back. So let me show you the final painting. But first I have to put it up on the easel. So. This is the final painting. That is the hidden girl. I actually ended up doing um, more painting. The next day, this is actually a couple days later because I've been lazy, but the next day when I actually finished it, I changed this cloud made it dark it was originally a lighter color and i added some more sparkles and then i almost forgot adding the orbs because it's like my thing for this collection so yeah here is the final result freaking love this look at her she is stunning stunning
I just love how soft she looks and she's just looking down. And there's my little signature over there. Yeah. So yeah, that is all that I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed it. I am in love with this new painting. But anyway, yeah, that's it. Um, like, comment, share, subscribe, do whatever you want. It does help me out though. Um, yeah. Um, uh, goodbye. <laughs> I'm done. Bye. <laughs>